so like my skin's been doing good i've been washing my face every day my pillowcases are clean I just finished getting ready. My hair is so greasy. I still haven't washed it because I keep working out and I just, yeah, I haven't washed it. I need to wash it tomorrow. But I'm finally like cute and like glammed up going out on a date with my girl Julia. We haven't seen each other. See, we have not. I'm sorry, I can't talk. We haven't seen each other in a really long time. The last time I saw her was my birthday in August. It's you guys know that's my girl. So we are going on a little oyster date. Uh, let me turn off these lights and stuff. There we go. I'm gonna give you guys. Tell me this is my lip gloss that I would have left. It fucking is. Um, I'm gonna give you guys a quick OOTD. I'm gonna bring this bag. Actually, really comes in handy. I don't know which purse I'm gonna bring. I'm just gonna put it in the car. Bring it in the car. So I'm gonna give you guys a quick OOTD. I was trying to find a cute outfit. I got a bunch of stuff from White Fox Boutique. Um, that I have to do a haul for, and I wanted to wear one of the pieces to take a picture in. But I didn't have enough time to, like, you know, I want my outfit to be, like, I don't want to regret styling it. Or I, I wish I could have styled it better. So I'm just going to wear something that I wore in Atlanta that I didn't get a picture in, which is just this bodysuit. This bodysuit makes your, your tatas just, I don't know, it gives them life. <laughs> but I'm wearing this black bodysuit from Lulu's with my black misguided jeans. Guys, I lost five pounds so yeah you could probably tell maybe not but i could definitely tell and then i'm just wearing my alexander mcqueen's but for my picture i'm gonna wear my black bottegas um i haven't brought them in to be repaired yet because i wear them all the freaking time so i don't know what i'm gonna do about that but i'm probably i don't know if i'm gonna take the risk and bring it to somewhere else and then i left my black puffer coat in clarissa's car so i'm just gonna bring this trench this is actually a really cute outfit. I'm in, I'm just wearing this trench from Boohoo. And then I have both my Louis Vuitton bag or my Balenciaga Hourglass Croc bag in my little bag over there. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys. We're going to, I don't know how to say it. We're going to Nomi Izayaka. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I have no idea. I just know that they have like sushi and oysters and stuff I'm excited the girl hasn't been out in a minute so yeah i will see you guys when i get there i mean it's wednesday looking all cute yes First time outside literally oh my god you look cute. No, is it locked? Crazy. Thanks. <laughs> Everything. Do you use the green one? No. The green one is pesto. Okay. 
I just have to want to wait So, I fuck it. Supposed to be going to look at some apartments today. Um, I just need to. I need to like just do my skincare and then sit down and open my agenda instead. But you know, we may or may not be doing some apartment hunting today. So I'm really excited about that. I don't know why I still did my makeup. No, I did not because I'm lazy. <sighs> Lord, I need to do like a scrub. I need. I need the works. I'm using my. I fucking love this cleanser, you guys. It's so good. Um, never gonna give you up. Never gonna. Mm, mm, mm. I'm gonna do a scrub and I'm gonna do a mask and all that stuff. I hate. I don't have makeup wipes. Whenever I don't have makeup wipes, I basically. Not having makeup wipes sets me up for disaster, aka um, not taking off my makeup. So I'm gonna use this makeup. Oh, Jesus, this makeup remover. I'm just using the Pharmacy Green Clean Makeup Melt Away Balm, Cleansing Balm. Um, not new here, you know, this is my shit. So, I hate taking off my makeup, but I did it to myself. wash and of course I have to do a mask because my skin's doing so well 
does anybody else's skin like when your skin finally starts to clear up your skin tries to give you little blemishes that you know shouldn't even be there like my skin's been clearing up so well and for the past two days this popped up out of nowhere i'm not falling for it um and then because i slept in my makeup that's gonna make it worse but I, you guys i haven't worn makeup in like two weeks like two weeks so like my skin's been doing good i've been washing my face every day my pillowcases are clean so I, I i really think like i don't know my skin's just being rebellious right now for no reason i'm not even gonna pick it there's nothing to pick but it's just like bro you see my you see you see my skin doing you see yourself doing good and you want to just come in for what there's not even anything inside what is that Anyways, I'm gonna use my Teamy Detox Mask. I've, I've um, worked with them a couple times, but this isn't sponsored or anything. This is actually the mask I use to detox my skin when I'm breaking out or when I've slept in my makeup. There's another fave I have as well, which is from First AP. This is a new mask. They sent this to me in PR. This is their Calamine Pore Purging Mask. Um, which one do I want to use? I don't know. You know what? Because I always use this one. I'm going to use this one. Yeah. I'm going to use put this one. I wasn't going to put the mask all over my face because I really just don't feel like doing that. Because this says you can literally just focus on your T-zone and oily areas. You can do that with the other mask as well. But I want to use this one. It's dermatologist tested, fragrance-free, safe for sensitive skin if you have sensitive skin. Um, just has to gently massage onto clean skin, focusing on T-zone and oily areas. Leave on for 10 minutes. That's what I'm going to do. And you can use this two to three times a week. I'm just going to... What's wrong, child? Okay, I'm only... <laughs> Do I... Yeah, this is about it. I need nothing crazy. One more yellow. That's it. So I'm gonna make myself some. I want tea. No, I want coffee, but I feel like I should do tea. But I'm gonna make coffee because I need it. I don't care. <laughs> to look here not here but i left my camera in the car yeah anyways as you guys can see i got ready and i'm heading out on a date 
um i just want to show you guys my makeup in case it gets all nasty and creasy when i get back and i wanted to give you guys an ootd i might have to wait till i come back because i don't know about this phone well it's my time to go right now my filming room is so messy i gotta put this dog in her cage um but this is what i'm wearing ignore my my washing machine and uh, did it she was and I do it again. I watch the ice get thin. How did she sink or swim? Honestly, it is just so much easier to vlog on auto because this is driving me crazy. Hey you guys, it's the next day. I didn't take my camera with me to my date, which I told you guys. So that restaurant, that was my first time going there. Um I actually always see um a couple of friends oh i don't have a mask shit a couple of friends of mine go like every week literally oh shit got this dark i parked so bad <laughs> oh it's not that bad yeah anyways i always see a couple of friends go like literally every week so um, i was really excited to go I can't see anything, but that food was a 10 out of 10. Like, it was so good. And now, it was so good. I actually brought some food back home. Food was amazing. I'm, of course, about to get my lashes. I feel like I'm here every week. I'm about to get my lashes done, so. Hey, hey. If you for anything, I told her anything. Got my lashes done. I went, um... I think last time we did 17, but this time I wanted to just make it a little longer. Because I feel like, I know a lot of you guys can relate when you get your lashes done and they start to fall out. And then you just, I don't know. I just feel like once they fall out, they'll have a little more oomph to it. It won't be as thin. Because at least they'll be a little bit longer. And I also made her go a little bit thicker. Because I sleep on my face. Sometimes. And one eye always gets, I think this eye always gets thinner anyway, so... I'm at the gas station. I've been answering my confessions. If you were tuned into my Instagram, girl, <laughs> y'all ain't shit. I love you guys though, but some of y'all ain't shit. Jesus. But um, it was really entertaining. A lot of people were tuned in. My views went like up a lot because the amount of responses and, and engagement in general, like so many people were sharing it. So. Um, a lot of more people were watching my stuff. But holy. Some of y'all are the reason I have trust issues. Um, I'm at the gas station. This is actually the second time I'm putting gas in my car. Because I don't drive that much. We're about to see how much it takes for me to fill up my tank. Oh my god, I, why did I park like this? Hold on. Um... You know, I'm used to regular gas, but now we do premium because you can't, you can't do <laughs> regular gas in this car. So we're about to see how much it's going to take to fill it up. But also, gas is so expensive right now. I don't know. I don't understand. I don't think I've ever seen gas this expensive. It's actually crazy. It's actually crazy. Big slam. I'm just gonna go on a little bit. <clears throat> and then. Perfect. We're about to see how much this is gonna take to fill this baby up. Ciao. <laughs> That's why I cannot relate. Load up the Drake. <laughs> 173. Good lord. It's so cold. I should have brought a jacket. <laughs> It's motherfucking cold, bitch. 
Oh my goodness. Let's see how much um, this fills my tank. <laughs> Not bad. All right, so premium right now is so expensive. It's 173. Well, first of all, regular gas is all I've known. And that shit is 145.9 right now. I don't ever, I can't remember the last time gas was that expensive. Gas has been pretty expensive for the past, like, I think, like, four or five months. But 145 is, like, that's crazy. So, premium is 173.9 um, a liter. And I put 65 in my car. I'm about to show you guys my dash. In, in case anybody's wondering. Um, I know in the States is different. I think you guys do it for um, gallon. Everything is just different. You guys do miles. We do kilometers. And that's why when I was driving the other day and I posted a s Instagram story and it said I was going 115 or 117, you guys were damning me like, Dana, slow the fuck down. <laughs> and then someone, one of you guys pointed out, they're like, oh my God, I thought it was uh, miles. It's kilometers per hour, you guys, not miles. But, um, so this is my dash right now. And as you can see, oh, I'm struggling right now. As you can see, this is my gas right now so when i pulled up my gas was literally half and i put 65 when you were here so it's not full so i'm guessing 75 70 75 would fill my tank on 173 i need gas to go down that's not bad at all though that is not bad my old car my mitsubishi rvr between 55 50 to 65 dollars to fill my tank depending on the price of gas so I don't know. So I know someone did say it would cost like ninety dollars to fill my tank, but the CLA two hundred and fifty is what I have, so it's a smaller engine. So um, yeah, this is like not bad at all. I'm there's a Tim Hortons drive through, and your girl would like some. You know, I think I want an orange. I want hot chocolate. Thank you. That was a lot. Um, I don't, yeah, this is like my favorite hand sanitizer right now from Dr. Bronner's. Shout out to Julia for putting me onto this like last year when I met her. <laughs> I keep one of these on me all the time. And it smells, oh, Oh, they probably have different flavor um, scents one, but this is the peppermint one. I mean, if you know Dr. Bronner's stuff, you know the blue one is peppermint. And it's organic. I hate that those freaking uh, hand sanitizers that smell like rum. Oh my god, what's going on here? Hate it. Hey you guys, I'm at my dad's house. Oh, I didn't. So this is like a bar. Yeah. What kind of furniture? You should put a hot tub. We have never taken a picture. But we have a set of furniture, like chairs and stuff over there. Chairs and table. Oh, and I forgot about this. Wait, what? We have chairs and table. We just wanted to take pictures before. We have chairs and table over here and chairs and table over here. But why, why do you need chairs and Like, like, like laundry chairs. Like, 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 uh, what do you call it?
See, we be making love constantly. That's why my eyes are a shade. Blood burning. The way that we kiss is unlike any other way that I be kissing. Well, I'm kissing what I'm missing. Won't you listen? Brown sugar, babe. I can't deny of your love. I don't know how to be. I'm a brown sugar. I want some of your brown sugar. I want some of your brown sugar. but the last time I had chili which was like like eight months ago my cousin when she brought her vegan chili for me to try she brought some over she brought them with tortilla chips I've actually never had tortilla chips with chili until she brought some but I always see people eat it with it yo you have to have the tortilla chips it's actually like a game changer with chili you guys like I don't know I love it now so I'm about to dip my chips in here I know you can like break it up as well too. I was gonna do that, but I don't know. I'm just gonna eat it like this. The chili is so good. Yeah, the chili is definitely. I already ate some, but the chili is definitely a nine out of ten. Why not a ten? Something about the way I I tried a different recipe. I mean, it's pretty much the same concept, but. I did, um, I watched somebody else's video. I think it was smoking and grilling with AB. I normally use my own recipe for chili. And today, I don't know, I wanted to, like, try it differently. So, yeah, it's still really, really good. But I've definitely made my chili way better than this in the past. But it's still good, you know. It's all good. And I'm tired, so I don't even care. <laughs> and I hope you're, you're afraid at night time. And in the day, I hope you're praying. And uh, when they get new things, they say thank you, Jesus, and glorify you. I do. You know, anything new, you say thank you. Thank you for it, because I even provided for you. You understand? Yeah. My car, it's a, it's a, it's a, not a Volkswagen, it's a Mitsubishi. <laughs> oh, 
It's at my dad's car shop. Would you call it a what's a jalopy? You know what? No, because you, if, if me ever say jalopy, you're going to you you believe. No, me not tell you when you're so. <laughs> but, <laughs> me glad. Nobody <laughs> worry about the jalopy. Nobody worry about it again. It's not in your picture anymore. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> when anybody said jalopy, I then basically I style your care old missus, but nobody get me wrong. Hmm? Mm-hmm. We have to move from big up from something to, to, to big something, eh? Yeah. Don't worry yourself, you look at your up here, alright, wait there, you know. <laughs> you don't need that little chill up here again. You bring it all over and it do all the way to possible feel. Yeah. <laughs> it do all the way to do feel there, you know. Yeah. And time for you get it up, because you cry bigger than that. Bigger than that, you cry. Hmm? Yeah. <laughs> but I'm little tell up in that one good to work on that time of year you started. I miss him a good year. Boom! What I time remember that I got me as a whole day and you just so like that up close. I'm a little tell up. I'm a father that took Benjamin. Then I reach home and I look at the little tell up. Trust me, then it's bring you. It's all good. A good tell up. It's 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 a good tell if you can't help your car, 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 you can not help your car you I said, I tell you, when I come when you come, I said, I tell you, I'm bad. I'm going to see your gun. I said, this is my gun. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to look for the gun. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to be brought down on the road because I tell you, I'm going to be tough. I said, no, sir. I don't have a good gun up here out there. You must miss it. No, I don't. You're not a lie. No. I don't say that. No, because... I I did a carry after way after way jump in never you give it all thing you know missus No I know I missed it at first but now I'm happy cuz it was time for it to go because the engine was so bad Yeah but you okay, you still must miss it you must have look a memory in it Yeah I still miss it You must have look remember come on man not do jello piece <laughs> I can, but I don't want to take the risk and then they mess up the shoe and then they can't replace it. Rather than if I send it to the actual. That's the thing though, I wear, they're my everyday black shoes. They're the black shoes I wear with everything. The only black comfortable heels I have, my everyday black heels. You can't wear it now. I mean, no, you're not going to wear chamba chamba. 
So, yes, it's funny. I'm wearing them tonight. The chamba chamba boot? <laughs> it's not chamba chamba, it's not that bad. You know, so the chai by the top, then it no more chamba chamba if, 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 if chai by the top. It's a little bit. I still want to fix it, but I can still wear it. Yeah, that's true. At night, nobody knows. Yeah, that's why, too. Mm -hmm. But it looks like so you have to go wear it at night, then. <laughs> <laughs> you have to every, every, everywhere you have on at night, you wear it, then. Because nobody knows. Nobody knows. Nobody knows. Shine light for your booty at night, then. Yeah. But then, if you be a party, you go, you have to go change it. I don't have a show. I have video light. I'm going to pick you up. Now you chamba chamba boot. Yeah, I don't want it like that. Really? You said, yeah, I wouldn't want that. Okay, yeah, and yeah, you remember saying you have big, yeah, yeah, big social media, so you don't want to go to the chamba chamba boot and all in the post. They're in a boot full of chai, chai, um, dog teeth. <laughs> big YouTuber boot full of dog, dog teeth. Eh? <laughs> the face well, well bright out in a nice Sunday green and all that. We don't want to read the headline about that. We don't want to read the headline with the about that part there. So you just wear the boot tonight. Yeah. <laughs> you got your boot tonight and look on it here. Just got ready. Everything's just big. So I'm wearing this top from Boohoo. And then my, you heard my aunt on the phone. My Chamba Chamba Bottegas. I haven't taken them in to get fixed yet. Clarissa's waiting for me downstairs. You're you can't be trusted anymore. So yeah, freedom's over. Still love you, but yeah. Good night. I don't know who told me to go out last night. Girl. I feel like shit. All I got to say. I want to cry. I did it to my freaking self. In 2.3 kilometers, turn left onto Burnhamthorpe Road West. Guys, I actually surprisingly put a bonnet on to sleep last night. I'm parked up here. I'm waiting for my realtor. Um, to get here, so we can go inside and look at this apartment. We're going to be looking at places all over. Um, we have a couple showings today. See. Oh my god, did Fendi and Skims drop today? Shut up. And a vlog run. Oh, no. We have... Like, I think five or six places to look at today. I'm looking all around. Yep, of course my battery's dying. Bye, guys. Oh. 
no, no. It's okay. <laughs> feel like the bedrooms are kind of small. No, they are small. And this, this would be the master bedroom, right? Yeah, this is small. Yeah, I feel like this is smaller than I have. Hmm? Yeah. I have a queen. Yeah, this is small. Small. This is thick. How much was this one? This one was 25. This one was... So I like the kitchen. Yeah, a lot. I like this a lot better. I mean, the room's still kind of small, but like, I don't know. This one's not. I'm trying to think. My... Uh, but right now, I, well, I have to get a new bed, but right now, the one the bed I have is a queen. I'll probably keep it. Are you sticking with the queen? Probably. Yeah, so it's gonna come up to a little bit. So there? Thanks. So you can take. Yeah, because then I would I have a two night table. The two night tables too? Yeah, so my bed is. I'm gonna see you. Yeah. It'll be okay. It's kinda of yeah. It'll be okay. Mm. Deep clean, yeah. This one's not too bad. You need us. You don't need much space for. For the second room, I just need a space for like filming and yeah. like my work, just work, like office and yeah. everything. So, I have a den right now. So anything bigger than a den yeah. is pretty. Yeah. Oh, the view over here is nice too. Hmm? Yeah, that's the thing like that's not the only thing. Where would I put my couch? You have to put it in this back row, because you put your TV over there, no? This back how would this work? What is it? What kind of what kind of couch it's is it? It's a sectional. sectional. I probably I might get a new sofa, but either way it's gonna be sectional. Yeah. I have one right now. So you can go this way. So okay. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. And then the TV on the one. That's the only place that TV, the TV would go. Right. I'm wondering what I could do. It's an awkward layout, but it's nothing I can't work with. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nothing I can't work with. You said this one is how much? I love the kitchen. Okay. Well, the kitchen is nice. Yeah, I'm like I love the kitchen. I love the deep sinks. And there's a lot of cabinet space mm -hmm. too, of which I need. Yeah, I like this one. Yeah. Uh huh. We'll go see the rest. Yeah. We put this down as number one percent in there.
a big um living room. Yeah, it's very big. Very big. Oh shit. It's a corner unit? No. This balcony is huge. It's from room to room. Holy shit. It's yeah, that's really big. Is it too big? No, it's oh. like it's it's nice. This is the Mm. It's a little tight. It's a little tight. <laughs> like the it's, yeah, it's workable. I like the bath. The bathrooms are very nice. Yeah. They are. Yeah. So there's a tub in the first one and then yeah. a shower here. Let me see the other room. This would be like my work office room. You guys, this balcony is long. Holy fuck. Oh yeah, it's right there. It's a nice view though. It's actually nice. Shit. The water view. Yeah. Nice little bridge and stuff. Let me not look down too far. <laughs> <laughs> uh -uh. Wait. Let me see. You know, I still have to get used to this. I forget that this is the, yeah, I forget that this is the fridge. That's the fridge, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. How's the fuck? That's nice. I can't even reach half of this. <laughs> <laughs> like, bro. <laughs> It's very nice. It's very nice. Lot of, lots of cabinet space. Yeah, it looks like you hmm? leave the first one to live in. Yeah, it looks it's like brand new, literally. Yeah. Sink is nice. Yeah, like the area is perfect. I prefer this over Mississauga. I'm just taking another video of this floor. What's that? Is that a, pan a pantry? Yeah. <laughs> These are things I won't even be able to fucking use. But. It's like little. Yeah, I gotta get a ladder. <laughs> a step stool. A step stool. <laughs> I do like this back into them. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Not bad? Mm -mm. My thing is too, well, I wish I could move this up a little bit more because I'm thinking like with bar stools. I don't oh. want it to block, yeah. Cause I don't, I'm, I don't want like a table or anything. No. I don't need that. I feel like, well, it's not too bad. I would get like- How many bar stools do you want? Um, three. But I mean, if I could, if I have you to do two. One here. You one here. <laughs> it's just cute. This place is cute. I like it. I like it. In 500 meters, turn left onto Richmond Street East. I look a little messy right now, so excuse that. I looked way better when I left my house. I don't know what's going on. Actually, I do know. It's windy as hell, and I need to wash my hair, so the hair isn't blowing in the wind how it should be. First of all, it's barely blowing because my hair is full of hairspray and grease and stuff but um girl that piece of hair no ma'am then you guys
guys can't even see me. I charged my camera before I left, but I guess I didn't charge it properly because I've been having to vlog all the units that I've been looking at on my phone because it died. But um, so far I like two of the places. I like one of them that's in Mississauga and then the other one is in Etobicoke. I live in Etobicoke currently, but I've never been to that side like where I was looking at. It's a new building. It's so nice. It's actually a hundred dollars cheaper in rent than the previous place we looked at the one i just showed you guys love it only thing is like i love the kitchen of the the first one i don't i'm not really i'm not really feeling that it's oh it's okay but i don't love it but um the second one i love and the third one is cute i love that it's brand new um i love the bathroom like i love the it's newer the second one it's not really like it's older so which is fine but like i don't know it's just the 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 third one is way more my vibe in terms of decor finishes and like aesthetic and everything but there's no walk-in closet i don't know if i was recording i was recording when you guys were a thing i have to figure out my whole closet situation so if i don't have a walk-in closet then it's like ideally three bedrooms is, is what would work for me but we're not doing three bedroom in toronto honey not right now <laughs> so because i'm gonna have three bedroom money in toronto i have three bedroom money maybe like in texas go past this light then at the next one and turn left atlanta or just anywhere cheaper than here but i'm gonna have no three bedroom money for toronto it's not a thing okay um so me there not being a walk-in closet makes it even worse for me so i'm trying to see if i could like i mean i would build a wardrobe anyways but it's like i needed a bigger i needed a two bedroom for work like for filming like packages products filming and i wanted to put my office in there as well i didn't really like having a desk out in my living room but if there's no walk-in closet then i might have to build a wardrobe in the second at room at the light turn left and i can Richmond like Street tweak East. it to make that just a whole beauty slash filming room like i mean that's the beauty of like having a, a beauty room or closet whatever room i don't know what i'm trying to say right now but the beauty of that is if you make it look really nice then you can just use it as a filming background regardless it's a vibe it's really like your personal style but then i would have to put a desk in the living room again it's way bigger the living room kind of than my place so yeah that's just some, some some things to take into account but we are pulling up to the next location this one is downtown toronto i always said i never would want to live downtown but it doesn't hurt to see and i think it's a little bit cheaper than the one in the mississauga so i mean thank you I gotta wait for these people to walk though i think we're pretty much here though in oh, 350 yeah, meters the destination is on your left 25 richmond Street i hate East. vlogging on my phone but you know what i know you guys will appreciate this more than me not getting anything <laughs> so yeah um i'll see you guys when i'm at the building girl my hair i'm supposed to get my hair done today or tomorrow i need to take this out and wash my hair so bad i got tracks falling out i have bobby pins and just holding on to faith and there's not much left <laughs> um i'll see you guys um when i'm at the apartment Okay, washer and dryer, then closet. One bedroom, sliding door. What? Yeah, that. It's definitely my type of fridge. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a glass wall. Closet's pretty big. Um, I wish there was a light in here. Oh. It's actually, it looks nice from here. I'm not gonna yeah. lie. It's not. I feel the living room isn't as big as the other ones. No. Like at all. That's the only thing. 
the bathroom I love like love and I like that there's a what do you call this again? Um, the towel um, the what's towel? the little door the fuck I first one but yeah I like this with the shelves for some storage space big drawer I love the shower. The kitchen's really nice too. I like this. This is brand new, right? Yes, brand new. Yeah. No balcony though. No view. They're still building this. Yeah. This closet. It's very small, but I feel like it looks big on video, but it's not. <laughs> Bathrooms of fire. I'm gonna shut this open. Okay. This is small. I'm trying to think of my bed. Yeah, this is really small. I'm not really much of a view either. Just oh, this is the linen closet right here? Oh no, no this is a little there's, closet. There's one um that's the closet closet. And then oh, this is the guest bathroom. Shower's nice. Oh no, this is washer and dryer. Oh, is it? Yeah. Balcony's good size too. Pretty good. Let's see. Deep closet. <clears throat> hmm? Lin yeah. <laughs> That's what it's called, yes. This is, a, this is pretty good, no? It, it's a, yeah, it's a good I size. 
you guys it is the next day chai's in her cage um because i'm leaving i have one more viewing today i just got out of a zoom meeting um chai stop hey guys it's the next day um i came home after i viewed the last apartment and some work i fell asleep so early last night i fell asleep at 11. i can't remember the last time i went to bed that early but i i was exhausted um so i'm on my way to one more viewing i only have one today it's in north york i was about to cancel because i just had a zoom meeting and i totally forgot and i thought it was going to be an hour but it was only half an hour so i'm like right on time <laughs> to go to this viewing a quick ootd i'm gonna show you guys what i'm wearing i'm just wearing this long sleeve um jumpsuit from white no white fox i'm so used to wearing this stuff naked wardrobe i'm wearing my yeezy foam runners and then i'm wearing my favorite jacket right now from zara i need to get another jacket i know they have like a faux leather one with like the the fur inside it's getting really cold so i actually need to invest in an actual winter jacket and then i just have my balenciaga um crock bag ignore my closet my house is so like i just ugh, girl i need to declutter clean i have a lot going on so my house is definitely reflecting that right now but we're about to be out so i'll see you guys when i get to the apartment yeah i'm just checking This room is so small. Like, really small. This would be the filming room office. And this is the master. It's pinch. Like, it's really, really small. <coughs> So these are the roses that were <laughs> waiting for me downstairs. I don't even know who these are from. I think I know who it's from, but obviously they never said anything. I don't even know. Girl, let me just open this, but I don't know. I wonder if it's even going to stay. These are so pretty. Oh my god, they smell so good. I can't rip this one. Okay. See, I just need to open this card. Something to brighten your day. And then it says their name. That's so cute. This is really cute. I feel special. Um, that definitely did brighten my day. These smell so, These smell so good. 
I'm just gonna take these. Like, I don't know where to put. Where do I put these, you guys? I don't even. Or am I supposed to, supposed to put them on my coffee table? Or under my TV? I don't know, but I'll figure it out. Anyways, I'm gonna put you guys on the charger. I got my hair done yesterday. Um, I used some old bundles and I didn't have time to get layers or anything because I was in a rush, but I want to go back and get layers at the front like I did with my last sew-in um, to match like my bangs or to match my leave out. And I want to take a couple tracks up because I thought I wanted it full, but girl, I just want it like super, super sleek and flat. Hey guys, it is later in the day and I'm just stepping out with um, Clarissa. We're just going to, it's not even like, I don't know the person, but she got invited to a birthday party. It's literally down the street from my house, like across the intersection. Um, so she asked me if I wanted to go with her. So I was like, yeah, girl, because I actually wanted to get cute to take pictures anyways. So yeah, I'm going to show you guys what I'm wearing really quickly. I could not find anything to wear. Um, today so this is what we are <laughs> wearing i was actually trying to style a blouse with these leggings but it was giving like church I ignore all my packages in the back but my leggings are from zara so obviously you know the top is from zara if you guys watched my last zara haul like from like a couple months ago this is the top i was showing y'all um i love buying things from zara like the, from the ripped collection because they always have stuff that match i bought these at two complete different times i bought these leggings in atlanta um, my booties are also from Zara. I have my Balenciaga hourglass crac bag. And then we have my jacket, which is also from Zara. Literally Zara on the whole fit. But I think it's cute. I don't know if I'm going to wear this for my picture. Not sure. But yeah, she's downstairs, so I'm going to go. I'm not going to vlog because it's not... I don't know. I'm just the, the plus one, so I don't really want to... You know, if there's anything to vlog, I'll vlog on my phone, but, um, yeah. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> hey, you guys. It is the next day. I didn't do shit today. Well, I did. I just edited. So, so I mean, like, there, I didn't do shit in terms of vlogging. But I'm about to go to my mom's house for dinner. I'm actually not hungry. I had chili earlier, like, a late breakfast slash lunch because I made so much chili. Chai, get out the bag. Um, I'm gonna go, I'm bringing my, my laptop to just do some editing and stuff. Actually a lot, I did do, other than editing, I did do one other thing today. And that is actually, I was looking for, or in search of a therapist. I've actually never been to therapy. I feel like, I mean, as I've gotten older, I realize oh. a lot, okay. <laughs> I feel like a lot of us need therapy. Yeah, I've just been, I've just had a lot going on and I realize the type of person I am, I'm not really the type of person to talk. I'm not usually the type of person to wanna talk about it. I, I just sulk and sit in my feelings and I shut down, but, as of lately, I've been wanting to talk about it. And like, you know, my friends aren't my therapist, so I, I need to find somebody. So I've been looking for black female therapists. I literally just searched black female therapist um, in, in Toronto or black therapist in Toronto. And I got a lot of, um, Twitter's honestly an amazing place to find things. I love Twitter, like, more than Instagram, to be honest. Um, yeah, so, like, there's just a lot of people that were... This girl actually made, like, a spreadsheet and, like, had a bunch of names. So I was really just, like, looking at all these therapists and just... Um, I, sent a I sent a couple emails for some consultations. One of the ones that I really wanted to meet with um, is for... A lot of therapists out here actually... <laughs> It's crazy. I mean, this is normal though, and this is good. Like, a lot of us do need therapy. I wasn't really, you know, growing up in a black household. Um, they're gonna be like, what therapy? They're like, therapy, what? But yeah, like, I'm deciding it's time. It's overdue for me. So, um, it feels weird because I never thought I would need therapy, but 
everyone actually needs therapy. I've just been really down lately, so I just need to like talk it out and just yeah, I'm getting emotional. Ew. <laughs> but yeah, so I need to finish doing that because some of the emails I sent out, I think two of them, they um, are full. They're not accepting any new clients, so I've just been you know, researching, trying to find one that's good for me. I was supposed to have a consultation tomorrow with one of the ones, but yeah, she's full. So she sent me some referrals, so I need to go through those. I don't know, you would think like, oh, buying things and buying a car would make it fix your problems, but materialistic stuff does not fix your problems at all. So yeah, anyways, my battery or my memory card's about to be full, and I'm just, I'm gonna go to my mom's. Chai, you ready? Come, come baby. We're gonna go. Uh, I'm still so mad about her chewing on my heels. Hi, I'm at my mom. Y'all wanna see your favorite person? It's cousin Mia. Say hey guys. Hey guys. You look nice today. Yeah. Show them your, your um, outfit. She looks so cute. Come, stand up. Give them a little OOTD. Okay, give them a little twirl. Okay, okay twirl. <laughs> Tell them where your outfit's from. Um, um, Dana bought it for me. I did not, but okay. She bought this one for me. I didn't. So, what, with this outfit, where did you go today? You have to talk louder because the TV is loud. I went, um, I went to church. You went to church? Yeah. You went to church, huh? I love the church outfit. Yeah, and Tay Tay's here. He's so cute, bro. He's one years old. Mm -hmm. I like him one years old because they're so cute when they're old. Show y'all my grandma. Say hi, grandma. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> huh? It's like my camera. Hi. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Say hi, Auntie Charm. Say hi. Hi. They don't even see the freaking knees. Oh, God, I love her. <laughs> well, I love you, too. Isn't she so pretty, guys? You should have taken me today when we go to church today. I'm going to pick some You should have come to us today and take me a picture. Oh, I wish I knew. You were dressed up? <laughs> Let go of my ear and... Yes. Wow. Uh... <laughs> She's so good. Thank you, Dana. No problem. Mia. What's going on here? Poor Chai. Do it again. I want her to bark I didn't know she was gonna do that. Chai. Chaka chai chai chaka chaka chai chai chaka chai chai chaka chaka chai 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 Okay, okay. Hey, you can always come back. 
It's okay. Hush. Hush. Don't cry. You're gonna come back. You come back every week. It's okay. Okay. You're gonna come back. <laughs>